Hello! Today is Friday, which means it's almost the weekend! Woohoo! So excited! Um, this video is going to be all about what a typical weekend in med school is like. Yay, the bed is done! And now we vacuum the floor. So you may have noticed in these past few vlogs, I have been home a lot not really going to all of the lectures. Uh, so today I went to two or three lectures and then I'm probably just going to work on the rest of them from home. Yes, so why am I doing this? Well, the thing about medical school is all of the lectures are pre-uploaded in advance so you can see all the slides. They also have the lecture recordings from last year so usually you can sort of pre-watch the lectures if you want um, because often they're the exact same and then the actual lecture from this year is recorded and that's uploaded within about 20 minutes of the lecture being over so as far as being there in person and going to class you're not really gaining anything unless you're the type of person who likes to ask questions that's not me so yeah, I've been doing it from home and the benefit to that I think is just being able to go at your own pace and also be really, really comfortable. Like I can watch lectures in bed, I can grab a snack. The lecture theater at my school is not the comfiest. I don't know why, but the desk is like too short. So your knees are constantly like hitting the desk and it hurts. It's also freezing cold in that lecture theater. So I'm super tired and I kind of want to have a nap, but I'm going to go to Starbucks instead and have some caffeine so that I keep this motivation going and hopefully get some work done and start the weekend off on the right foot. <laughs> so slight change of plans, I'm going to go for a brisk walk before Starbucks because <laughs> I left my wallet at home. <laughs> So this is my version of a wild Friday night. I am now going to attempt to work out. Guy who carries me into the office every night. E. So it's Friday, it's 10.30 p.m. and I've literally done no schoolwork this evening, but I also didn't go out and have a fun time. I've just, <laughs> I worked out and I've sat on my bed and I think I watched Ellen's YouTube channel for like a solid three hours. My ponytail looks super long like this. Anyways, just had a thought. I think as students, whether you're doing your undergrad in something unrelated or you're a pre-med or a med student, I think we have like a lot of guilt around productivity. We make these lists of things we want to do, we have these goals and we want to crush them and accomplish them, but we forget that part of achieving those goals is taking breaks and taking time to re-energize and just avoid burnout and I think that's something that I really have to work on because like tonight, tonight was fun but I went in starting my Friday night thinking I'm gonna review this material and then I didn't do it and now I'm like disappointed in myself Ugh, so if you've had a lazy day you're watching this vlog don't feel guilty um, take breaks as you need them and then be efficient in the times when you choose to work. <sighs> yeah. Good morning. Today is Saturday. Saturdays I usually sleep in a little bit. I try to just wake up when my body feels naturally ready to get out of bed. I find that's a great way to feel refreshed and well rested and have a great start to a productive weekend. 
Eh, so I'm starting the morning off right, seeing how much money I have, um, so that I can decide how wild I want to go this weekend. So this is my budget. My goal is to spend around $100 a week. Alrighty, so some days I love to study from home, but today I just want to get out of the apartment, have a change of scenery, and have some amazing coffee. So, let's roll. It's a beautiful day! It is crisp and fresh out, unlike my voice. I got myself a burger. Hello, so I'm back home from a long day of hopping around different coffee shops. Um, I feel pretty good about how productive I was today. Good morning, today is Sunday and I'm off to, you guessed it, Starbucks. <laughs> I'm on my way to Starbucks, I brought my comfy slippers so that my feet are happy while I'm studying. I just wanted to share that I have been taking vitamin D for like four days now, not that long, but I think it's really making a difference. My mood is really, really elevated and it's, it's hard to tell because there's a lot of things that play into your energy levels and how you feel and maybe this is just the placebo <laughs> and I'm like ah oh, vitamin D is gonna make me feel amazing but I don't know what's going on if it's the vitamin D I'm really really impressed I feel amazing <laughs> Hello, so I'm home from Starbucks, did a little bit of studying, worked on anatomy all morning, and now I'm going to be working on my vlog. I just had lunch, so I'm just kind of taking a break to get re-energized, rest and digest, and then I'm going to work out, and then hopefully study some more. So my mom came all the way into town and she cooked me a bunch of food. We cooked together. It was so much fun to hang out and now the freezer is full of food. The fridge is full of food. It's delicious. It's nutritious and I feel like I'm set to eat healthy um, approaching this exam period. So that feels really good and it was really nice to hang out and visit and chat. Yeah, so that concludes my weekend. And that's what a study weekend looks like. It's not that exciting, but it's the reality of working hard. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.